You're watching a Sony Vegas compilation. What's happening guys, my name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new Vegas 14 tutorial. And yes, I know guys, there's no face cam because this video was actually recorded at uh, 1 a.m. So I'm just going to just record lots of videos, make them all be great, and just go ahead and uh, just quickly make this uh, bulk uh, series of videos. But don't worry guys, next week I will be back with Facecam. Before you guys are going to spam, hashtag bring back Facecam. I know there is no Facecam today. There will be no Facecam in the Deep Web video of Monday and the Photoshop tutorial of Tuesday. But there will be a Facecam in the Vegas, for, uh, Vegas 14 tutorial uh, that's coming next Wednesday. So make sure to just stay calm. This is just one video without Facecam. So I would say let's get started. So as you can see right now in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a gaming or like how to make a commentary in general. General, and I'm going to uh, use a gaming commentary for this. So as you can see, I have some Overwatch gameplay right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to commentate over this. But first, before this video starts, I want to ask you guys to smash 300 likes. That should be easy. So make sure to just go ahead and do that. And let's start off. So as you can see, this is the Overwatch gameplay, like I said. And right now, what we're going to do, the first thing is we're going to lower the volume of the game sound. Because it's really loud when you're going to talk over the video. It's going to be, it's going to be really distracting and annoying. So we're going to lower the opacity of the of the audio to at least 12.7 decibels then we're going to cut away some of the waiting uh screens as you can see there's no need to show this just waiting so i'm just going to just start and cut from where the game starts that's right here i'm going to delete this part so just press s on your keyboard then we're going to add in a nice fade in i'm going to make it start at the beginning so this is what the gameplay already looks like So that is your gameplay, that, that, that looks really great, but as you can see, the screen isn't really um, like popping out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to a uh, right click, we're gonna do properties, and we're gonna un uncheck maintain aspect radio and disable the resample. You will notice the difference, but it's just a really small detail. So that's one thing. The second thing is we're gonna go to video effects and we're gonna scroll all the way down until we find uh, brightness and contrast. And I'm going to just, as you can see, I have a lot of templates. I'm going to just pick my videos template, drag it on top of your timeline, and boom, it looks way, way better. So let's see what it looks like right now with all the settings on full. All right, guys, so as you can see, there's a pretty big difference. I'll show you guys right now. There is a difference between this and this. Do you guys see the difference? This one is the first imported footage to this. Boom, a lot of, uh, lots more saturation. So the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna record our voice in Sony Vegas. You don't need to uh, use Audacity like I do for a separate program. We're gonna do just do that in Audacity, in, in, I mean, in Vegas 14, you will be just fine. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add in an audio track, as you can see see boom then we're gonna click on this little red icon make sure that your microphone and everything is plugged in and configured then we're gonna click on it I'm going to just click on OK and now as you can see the sound bar is popping up what we're gonna do is we're going to press record and we're gonna commentate over there I'm just going to pretend that I'm gonna record a commentary for story time so I'll show you guys what I mean <clears throat> What's up guys, my name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new Storytime episode. And in this video, guys, I'm gonna show you guys uh, about the ad boycott that's going on right now. So more than 250 uh, companies have pulled out from YouTube because ads were showing on extremism videos and everyone's revenue has been dropping by at least 25%, I believe. Okay, I'm gonna cut right there. But as you guys can hear while I'm talking, this, the volume of the game is still too loud. So I'm just gonna lower that to uh, 18.8 and uh, let's hear what my commentary uh, looks uh, sounds like but as you can see I'm clearing my throat right here I'm gonna cut away that I'm gonna just I'm just gonna cut to where the sound is starting so I'm gonna delete that so uh, let's see what it looks and sounds like what's up guys my name is Alex welcome back to a brand new story time episode and in this video guys I'm gonna show you guys uh, about the ad boycott that's going on right now. So more than 250 uh, companies have pulled out from YouTube because ads were showing on extremism videos and everyone's revenue has been dropping by at least 25%, I believe. 
Okay, so that sounds really great. It looks really great and it, it is just like a commentary how it should be. So I think this is all you guys need to know. Make sure to just apply some color correction or brightness and contrast onto your clip. Make sure that your microphone is, cor is, is configured correctly. Just start recording. I'm just going to uncheck this one because this bar is actually pretty annoying. So that is how to do it, guys. This is how you record a voiceover. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this video was helpful to you. Make sure to smash the like button down below. Let's go for 300 likes. That should be possible. That should be easy. So I want to thank you for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new Evolving into a Better YouTuber episode, as always on Saturday. So I will catch you guys tomorrow. All right, folks. Welcome back to a new video. And I probably look like shit. I burned all over myself. As you can see, I cut myself with shaving. It's so so hot outside and in this video guys i decided to show you guys how to actually film with your phone and make the best videos possible so most of the most of you people don't have access to those really expensive compact canon g7x cameras and etc i'm going to show you guys just with your iphone 5 6 7 maybe even 8 when you're watching this when the phone is out i'm going to show you guys how to make the best videos possible with only your phone so as you can see right now i'm just using my iphone 7 and most people what they do is they will actually film like this but as you can see in the editing it looks really crappy the only thing you want to do is you just want to turn your phone sideways as you can see right now so this is basically how you actually film yourself and that's how you actually look like a vlogger as well because many people are filming like this as you can see so this is basically the method how to film yourself don't hold your phone up because as you can see on my phone it fills the entire screen but on the editing it is just a just a huge black bar all around I'm gonna show you guys right now in Vegas how to do that and how to edit that so I would say uh, let's get started all right guys we're on Sony Vegas as you can see right now but as you can see I'm in the corner with a face cam border because I don't have uh, my green screen behind me I don't have my new intro because I lost my well I don't have access to my external hard drive and all my YouTube files are on there my intro my background music so i have to download some ncs music real quick from the internet i will have access this weekend back uh, onto my hard drive but for right now i'm just going to stick with this and i don't have my intro available but just th that's going to be only for a few days so as you can see right now this is my vegas project and this is how it looks when you are filming uh, with your phone up so as you can see if i play back the video on your phone it looks great but in the editing we have huge huge black bars now to fix that like i said at the beginning of this intro you just want to make sure and you want to tilt your phone sideways like i'm gonna do right now as you can see i'm just going to tilt my phone sideways that you got that you guys are seeing right here and then this will be your image like i said at the beginning of this video that is how to do it because the how to make the best videos possible is going to be really simple now now that so now that I have explained to you guys why you should tilt your phone it's time to edit uh, the footage so I'm gonna just drag in the clip that I shot with my iPhone with the with the phone uh, uh, screen tilt as you can see right now what we're gonna do first of all is we are going to add some brightness and contrast to it so we're gonna go to video effects and we're gonna go over and look for brightness and contrast we're gonna drag the default one on on top, of, on top of our clip and we are going to mess with the contrast so as you can see I'll make it a little bigger as you can see this makes a huge difference so now I'm just putting up the contrast a little bit the brightness is not really necessary because the Sun is already shining but as you can see if I play back the video this is how to how to make your videos the best with your iPhone or on Android you just want to apply some color correction up apply some brightness is in contrast and that is basically how to do it because as you can see most cameras these days on all uh, cell phone cameras have really great quality so you don't need to go ahead and buy a $500 G7X or a compact camera or anything like that you can just use your phone 9 out of 10 so this is how to do it guys make sure to tilt your phone and apply some brightness and contrast so I want to thank you for watching make sure to smash the like button down below also the subscribe button at the bottom so I want to thank you for watching I'm just going to just uh, go ahead and edit and upload this video because it's so freaking hot outside. So I want to thank you guys for watching. My name is Alex. Thank you for the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new Vegas, uh, Audacity tutorial. As always on Thursday. So I will catch you guys tomorrow.
What is happening guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new Vegas 14 tutorial and in this video I'm gonna show you guys how to create an intro using a template and I can already hear you guys in the comments like dude you already have done a video with, like about this topic well guys that was in 2015 I believe so that's over two years ago so I want to make a 2017 a updated a newer version to show you guys how to make an intro using a template now as you can see right now I have a folder downloaded from YouTube uh, so what I did I went on youtube.com and I just typed in the search bar uh, free intro template Sony Vegas and then I found tons of videos and I just downloaded a intro template that I like and now that zip file is extracted on my PC as you can see right now we have all the files uh, into uh, or a folder but what we're gonna do is we're gonna customize it because the music is also copyrighted so we're gonna uh, like replace the music as well so I'm just going to just click on this Vegas project as you guys can see you guys will see how it will look so I'm gonna put on my headset because there's audio obviously and let's see and let's edit and let's customize it uh, to our own wants and needs so as you can see right now I'm just going to click on ignore missing files and leave it offline so this is basically our intro template guys I'm gonna delete the music with because that is copyrighted but this is what the template looks like unedited As you can see, that looks really cool, and that is our template. Now, what we're going to do, first of all, the first thing is we're going to change uh, the name, the font, and we're going to change that to my own name, just Alex Halbert. So we're going to click on this little icon, which says uh, Generated Media. Then we're going to select everything, and I'm going to type in just Alex Halbert, and I'm going to pick a nice different font than this one. So let's just go, uh, go ahead and browse. I think this one looks really pretty. Uh, 10 cent Soviet I think it is so let's close it out and let's see what it looks like so as you can see uh, this is the template it's just moving on the music that it came with uh, but I'm just going to uh, leave that and we're gonna add in some NCS music so I'm just going to press on the Windows key I'm gonna press NCS and I'm going to drag make me move and you guys are probably familiar with that song so I'm just going to uh, skip to the drop well to the to the first first then I'm gonna cut away and I'm going to press this I'm gonna put this one into my timeline and let's make a fade out right here so this is what our intro looks like Open eye. Feel the waves cut through me Hypnotized By the sounds I'm breathing By the sounds I'm breathing But she says breathing in So I'm gonna make it a little bit longer By the sounds I'm breathing in so as you can see, that sounds really great. So this is our template, guys, that we just edited. So a template is basically uh, a intro that's already made for you. It's pre-made, so you don't. So you just only have to uh, edit your text, and that is how to do it, guys. This works for any other intro that's on there on YouTube. And if if and I receive a lot of comments on the previous video, like, dude, I cannot edit the text, uh, or something is not working. Well, guys, I have no idea because this one is pre-made, so I would just look for a different one. That's the only method you can do uh, and that you can use as well. So this is our template. Open eye, feel the waves cut through me, hypnotized. By the sounds of breathing in so that sounds really great and that looks really great so that is it guys that is how you edit a template an intro template and that's how you make an intro uh, really simple by just using a pre-made intro uh, downloaded from YouTube so that is it for this video thank you for the continued support and I have really great news guys the silver play button will arrive uh, this Tuesday the 23rd of May so I'm really stoked for that I'm just gonna make the unboxing as well next week Wednesday so there will be no Vegas 14 tutorial Wednesday but the, the silver play button uh, unboxing will replace that video. So that's a one on mention, guys. Thank you for the support. I'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new evolving into a better YouTuber episode as always on Saturday. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Just Alex Halford.